a little bit of knit weaving is very easy to do and it can add an enormous amount of pizzazz to a sweater. Here's how. This is a new little jacket I have made and I want to show you how to get this effect. It's just a version of knit weaving but we're going to make a couple little changes that make it unusual. First oddity is that I'm going to use Red Heart Scrubby yarn, which is really meant for making washing cloths and things. And that's what creates that odd textural quality that I think looks rather vine-like. And what I'm doing here is I've put a piece of paper hung on my gate pegs to hopefully make enough contrast that you can see a little better. To begin, just hang the yarn over one needle. I pull it all the way out and let it knit back from hold. Knit two rows. Now, to make the vine, we move. So I'm using the needle one to the left of where we were, looping the yarn over, knit two rows. We're going to move to the left one more time and knit two rows. Now we're going to stay in this position, but keep looping the yarn over for a couple of times. One lift and knit two rows. Two lifts and loop. Knit two rows. And now we go back the other way. One needle to the right, knit two rows, one needle to the right. Don't get hung on the gate peg. Knit two rows. Now we're on the right hand edge of the arc. There was some light for you. We'll repeat what we did on the left. Lift it once, loop it over, knit two rows. And do it on the same needle again. I'm sorry I'm wavering. I have to hold the camera in one hand and knit with the other in order for you to really see this. And I wish that I was as steady as a rock, but I don't seem to be. Here's what we're getting. And now we will go back to the left. Let's do that so we complete the second curve. So obviously the effect only shows from the pearl side of the fabric and with my weight hung on it, it doesn't look like much. As it relaxes, it will look better. I'll show you in a sec. Here's our wandering vine finished. I've woven things into the edges of the fabric because I didn't do anything about making it stopping rolling from my knitting. So now all we have to do is place flowers in these little curves and that's what's going to create the flowered vine look. Very simple, really. Go on to the next video on French Knots on Knitting for that.